2020, what a year it's been. COVID-19, we got racial injustice, and now here we are, a Cat 4 hurricane that has hit our land and has devastated our region. You know, we've been in this series talking about stop going to church, that the church is not a special event, it's a spiritual family. It's not a hotel, it's a hospital. It's not a building, it's a body. And today, we're talking about how the church is not an audience, it's an army. You know, it's amazing, and I just love how God works, is we had already planned on doing this message prior to when the hurricane hit. But God was telling us that in this moment, it's time for us not to just go to church, it's time for us to be the church. And you have been that, and I just wanna say thank you. As the senior pastor of Our Savior's Church, from all of our campuses that have come and rallied around our campus and around this region, I wanna say thank you. From the team in Eunice that came and brought over 40 people to help us bring relief and tarp roofs and cut down trees, to the, to the teams in Crowley that have been here at the distribution center and feeding and helping with relief work, to our team right here in Jennings that have been in this distribution warehouse almost every day. Thousands of cars that have passed through this distribution center that have not only gotten supplies, but have gotten prayer. As I'm here in this distribution center, this is a God story in and of itself. We had been looking for a distribution center and two businessmen in town found out about it and said, we will shut down our business so that you and the churches that you're partnered with can use this to bring relief and help to this region. This has been one of the greatest blessings. But not only that, as many of you know, Eight Days of Hope is now stationed at our Jennings campus and hundreds and hundreds of volunteers have been stationed and mobilized out of our church to go and be the hands and feet to bring relief all around our region. On top of that, we're also housing over 50 police officers from all over the state at Jennings High School that are being uh, helping the Lake Charles police as well. We're doing laundry for the, the linemen and for uh, people here in the city that need it. I just wanna say, none of that could happen without you. You're not an audience, you are an army, and you have been an army. And as we know, we still have a long way to go, but I wanna say thank you. Thank you for your generosity, thank you for your support, thank you for serving, thank you for giving sweat equity into our city and, and serving people however you can. Thank you for donating. We are better together. And one of the most beautiful things is seeing not only our church, but churches all over this region and all over the city coming together and saying, we are better together. We're gonna to do this together. It's time for us to stop going to church. It's time for us to be the church. And we're gonna to continue to be that church in our city because I believe the local church is the hope of the world.